Hey, it's Mindy Kaling, and I am here to answer all of your burning questions. Hi, Mindy. I was wondering, what is the best thing that you've ever worn? I've worn a lot of great stuff, but probably my personal favorite was this one-shouldered yellow satin Gucci gown that I wore to the 2010 Golden Globes. The fact that I can just tell you it can give you some indication of how obsessed I am with this look, but I just loved it. I'm like wearing no jewelry. I have like kind of like late Chinese, like joie de vivre. I don't think I'm wearing a bra, probably should have been, but I just love this look. Hi Mindy, so the question that I have for you is, what is your biggest pet peeve? So my biggest pet peeve is when people say that they are quote, bad with names. No one is bad with names. It just means that you are careless and don't want to learn a name. Hi Mindy, I heard you speak live once where you said you were often called a coconut, brown on the outside and white on the inside. I have felt like that my whole life. I wondered how you navigated that process, both professionally and personally. I sound like I was born and raised in Encino, and I don't speak any Indian languages because my parents came from totally different parts of India and met each other learning English. So I didn't grow up speaking Hindi or Bengali or Tamil, although people in my life did. And because of that, I always felt really vulnerable as a kid that I wasn't, you know, Indian enough as some of my Indian friends, but I'm clearly not white, but I sound white. So for me, it was always kind of painful in the past 10 years, I would say, I've had a lot of fun um, working and creating shows that really celebrate people that look more like me. I'm really now fascinated with, instead of avoiding this idea that I'm like an other, really embracing it and saying why it's funny, why it feels real. So that's kind of how I'm dealing with it is through art. Hi, Mindy. I'm a big fan of all the fashion you wore on The Mindy Project. And I'm wondering if any of Salvador Perez's designs made it into your own closet. Yes, they did. The answer is yes, they did. Mindy Lahiri had the sickest costumes and so many of them were custom. So when the show ended and there was literally thousands of costumes, I didn't want the custom pieces to just go back to Universal. So I took the very, very most special pieces that I like couldn't live without. Some skirt suits that he made me, some coats, this really uh, beautiful yellow dress that I wore when I was actually like seven months pregnant in life um, that I wore in the last season and I bought them. You don't get clothes for free as it turns out, but I did get a nice discount. Hi Mindy, my name is Ava. So I'm currently in the process of potentially switching my major. I'm in college and I'm a little bit confused as to what I want to do with my career in the future. And I was just wondering what you do um, for yourself to figure out what you really want in times of confusion. So thank you. Oh boy, switching majors is really hard. I think that whenever I feel confused, I always try to talk to three people someone who's like family member, someone who is a friend, and then someone who I really look up to who is not in my immediate family. So like a professor or an old high school teacher or something, because I think that that perspective really gives you a balance as to like what you should do, because each individually people are sometimes biased by you know certain things that they want from you. For me, I always felt that whenever I'm rushed, I think is when I feel the most confusion. And it's very not my personality to give myself some time, but if it is all possible to just say, okay, I'm gonna spend this one week and just think about like what I really wanna do. I'm gonna see a ton of TV, I'm gonna watch movies, I'm gonna try to go on a trip or something. And suddenly one morning you just wake up and it becomes really clear. That's the only thing I'm really certain of is that it always just like happens. That's my advice. Indeed, question for you. Which role did you have more fun playing? The role you had in The Office or the role you had in The Mindy Project? Both looked super fun to write and act in, so I was curious. Oh man, this is a tough one, but Mindy Lahiri, look at those costumes. Hi Mindy, my name is Vanessa, and I was wondering, since you just have such an amazing sense of style, would you ever consider making your own clothing line? Yes, and I even have the name of it. Hello, Mindy from your very favorite vegan. My name is Hema, um, and I have a very important question for you. What vegetable would you be and why? Artichoke, you have to like peel it back, takes a lot of work, and there's just a little bit that tastes good. Kind of high maintenance, sexy. Hi, Mindy. <laughs> Our favorite book right now is Snowy Valentine, and we were wondering what your favorite childhood book was. Harriet the Spy. This was so much fun. Thank you so much for sending in all of your questions. I love getting to know you and I hope we can do this again. Bye.